There's nothing more important than picking your spots in a college basketball game. Javon Powell, Colonels, they snap a five-game losing streak to Texas A&M Corpus Christi. Final score is 68-64. to Mr. Powell, four second-half three-pointers. Fourth one was the backbreaker. Made sure that A&M Corpus Christi would not come back in this game. Why was your shot right in the second half? Uh, just the confidence. Uh, me and my assistant coach, Coach Klontz, work extra every day to make sure that I can make and take shots like those when the time comes. So when it comes time, I'm as confident as ever that I can put it in the basket. One of the best defensive teams you'll play in the Southland Conference came in here, disrupted the, the concentration of this offense, and, and held you guys to 31 points in the first half. You score 94 against Incarnate Word in the opener, but every game is different. And, and to come out of the second half, take a three-point lead, Extend it to 11, maturity, patience, and not worrying about those turnovers that created such offensive issues in the first half. Exactly. Uh, we got one of the oldest teams in the country, so we've had guys and we have guys that have been through here and have done this thing for years to come now. So the pressure never gets too high. We just always stick with the game plan. We stick with the preparation from all week. Like uh, this instance, we only had a day, but we felt prepared and we felt like we had a good game plan to come in here and get a dub. And that's exactly what we did. So it was good, and it felt good to be prepared. Where does the, the maturity make its biggest impact in the second half of close games? Uh, definitely when it gets close. Uh, we work on situationals every day in practice. We've been in close games already at the beginning of this year that is helping us now later in the season come conference time. So it's the best feeling in the world knowing that you're prepared for when these times come and you can show up when it does and thrive under pressure. That's our motto. Well, and there's so many subtle built-in advantages that, that you've had in these first two conference games when the game's gotten a little tight late in the second half. Yeah. You've been in the double bonus, and you've had their best players in foul trouble. Now, they, they turned an 11-point deficit, cut it to three, and had the ball. No pressure, no panic, and you were the team that executed down the last 60 seconds when it would have been easy to think, okay, Corpus Christi's on the run. This is the number two team in the conference from a year ago. This is when they make their move. You step back, hit a three. Jonathan Bell hits a big free throw. Four-point win. Yeah, uh, it's a different team this year. You know, we got a lot of guys that can step up, and tonight was just one of those nights. I think we had three or four guys in double figures, and everybody came to play. I think this was our best defensive game on the season just all around from our wings to our mm -hmm. bigs to our top guys. And it's just a great overall feeling, man, knowing that you, we can win games like this at home and protect our home court like we've said all season long. Time to take the show on the road. Three straight road games against Sam Houston State, Northwestern State, and Stephen F. Austin. Where, where do you see the most encouraging signs about the, the complete effort that it isn't just relegated to home games? That this team can take a four-game winning streak, bring it away from Thibodeau, and, and pick up three wins on the road? Oh, uh, we've traveled all over the place this year, so it's going to be nice to travel a little closer now that we're in conference. But, you know, playing at home or playing on the road, we're going to come with the same preparation, the same focus. We just try to be the same whether we're at home, on the road. We just go, want to pl go, play hard, and, and win. The main focus is win, and we know if we can keep winning, then we're going to be exactly where we want to be at the end of this thing. The mentality is to take it. Nothing's going to be given to you. If you want the Southland Conference Championship, go and get it. Yeah, exactly, and that's exactly what we're trying to do. That you're not afraid to say that has people a little bit uh, ill-prepared for the confidence in the conversation that the Colonels are, are, are stating. And it's not just privately. You, you guys have been comfortable looking into each game and letting everyone know that we're winning this because it will lead to a conference championship. When did the conversation first turn to the big picture dreams that this team was ready to chase after? When we all got here and we all started to put that work in from the summer to the beginning of preseason and now all the way to this point, uh, the confidence is in the preparation. So we're just as, as a confident team as ever, and we're just getting more confident as the games go on. And it's just a great overall feeling. Can you ask for a better start to 2017? No, not at all. It's the best one I can ask for right here. Javon Powell and the Colonels are 9-6 and six on the year, but they snap the five-game losing streak to A&M Corpus Christi. 2-0 atop the Southland Conference, three straight on the road. And if you are in Thibodeau or Homa or South Louisiana, Stuff Stouffer is the first 
home game after the road trip. Yeah. Look around and enjoy seeing this place empty for the moment. There won't be a single available seat for your next home game. Yeah, that's going to be the most exciting part, man. Come out and watch. It's going to be a show. Four second half threes for Javon Powell. Colonels win 68 to 64. Enjoyed having you along. First sweep, Lady Colonels win by 20. Men pull away late, beat one of the premier teams in the Southland Conference, and they never trailed in the second half. For the Colonels Digital Sports Network, my name is Bryant Johnson. This has been Colonels Basketball on GoColonels.com.